So this is my art studio. It's an iPhone 6 Plus, and I want to take you through some of the apps that I use to create art right on my phone. So the first one I want to talk about is Adobe Capture, and it's right here. I'm going to touch on it. And when I do that, it brings up the, uh, the screen with all the choices you have. From here, you can touch on shapes, and you can take a photo and reduce it to, to what looks like a black and white pencil sketch or positive negative shape. So that gives you an idea of what we're going to do with this app. It's just the beginning. So let's go to another part here in Capture, which is Patterns. And here I can take a photograph and I can change that photograph uh, to look like a pattern. And I have some different choices here that I can use. So this is just kind of a really quick run through. And I'm going to go into detail in later videos, but just to kind of show you what you can do with that. And another part of this is colors. So I can choose colors that are already created. I can choose colors from photos that I might take. So I could grab anything that's right here in the room and I could create a color scheme from that. You can also go to my camera roll by touching that little thumbnail in the lower right hand corner and then I can bring up any image that I have, any, any image that I like. And you know, let's say, for instance, this, this abstract I created, maybe I want to change it a little bit. I can move these around. And when I like it, I can touch that circle and I can save it. I could further adjust it. So that is really a quick um, sh you know, little, little demo of Adobe Capture. So I'm going to get out of that. I'm going to go to Adobe Draw. Because what I want to show you with Adobe Draw is if I touch this little orange circle with the plus sign, I can bring up a piece of paper or a canvas that is going to end up with the ability to print it really large. Okay, so it's on a little phone. However, if I send this off to one of the internet printers, I could do something that's 14 by 11 or 18 by 24. And if I get a piece of paper here, let me show you how that Adobe Capture um, image uh, or um, shape can be brought into this draw program. I'm going to touch the little um, triangle and circle, and then I'm going to go to one of my libraries, and you can see there are already saved shapes in here that I can bring in. So I'm going to touch that one, and I can change the color here. Let's say I want to make it a blue. And when I touch it, maybe I pinch it, make it a little bigger, tap, tap, and then there you have it. So that's a very cool, quick way to get a drawing, uh, you know, right onto a piece of paper. So there are just two apps right now. That's Adobe Capture and Adobe Draw.